there are people complaining about Kevin Harlan's call during the Syracuse Virginia game. Syracuse came back. I mean, he's had something like a 30 to 8 run to beat the number one seed, Virginia. And as they were finishing the game, he said words to the effect of Syracuse. Well, he didn't say Syracuse came back from the dead. He didn't say that exactly. And the reason why I really harp on that as I'm looking over at the quote to get another look at it, because USA Today calls it a controversial statement. I watched the game and listened to the call. I didn't... That sentence went right past me. Yeah, it didn't, it didn't phase me at all. It didn't make me give me pause and scream and say, oh, you shouldn't have said that. And it was because he said Jim Beheim and Syracuse have done it back from the dead on Easter Sunday. Okay. Uh, I, did I say anything wrong with that? No. Did I think it was a, a brilliant piece of English work? No. It was just a term. And I think what, for me, uh, the issue is I watch sports so much, as probably you do, that I'm used to people throwing out colorful phrases like that, and it doesn't catch me one way or the other. I didn't think it was blasphemous. I mean, because it just didn't strike me that way. Are we too sensitive? No, I think we're appropriately sensitive. I don't. I don't think that this is in some indication of uh, somewhere we've gone off the rails and we've become too neurotic. Although there are examples in society, occurrences where one could say we have, but this isn't one of them. He turned a phrase on Easter Sunday that he felt was, you know, appropriate to the moment. I wouldn't have used the term, but. Is this something that he needs to turn around and say, hey, really, I'm sorry for? Well, I think given the human cry, yeah. he Just just get it out of the way and so we can all move on. And rather than being arrogant about it and saying, well, I don't, I don't owe anybody an apology. But it would be a good idea just to say, hey, that phrase I used, I didn't mean to insult anyone. I can understand if some were offended and let's, you know, move on. That's it. That's it.